actual weapon, so I gotta get that first. Yeah, the catalyst um, from Zer. at the moment for this season, the, the Trinity Gold catalyst just drops after doing like killing like a single enemy, pretty much. You sure about that? That's how it did it for me. It's it for everyone I've heard on Reddit. First enemy yeah. I killed in the season dropped the Trinity Gold. Right yes, that, that's what I get for not being on Reddit. Yeah, second I started the season, second I logged in. Day of reset of, of the season. Went to Mars, killed a thrall, dropped the Trinity Gold. And then I got it completed Sir. like a week later. And that catalyst is a beast. Makes the weapon so it's overpowered. awesome. Were you using yeah. Trinity oh, Gold when you killed that thrall? To... <laughs> just, had a, just had a random look at him. Yeah. Oh. Bounties, bounties, grabbing all the bounties. Uh, no, I finished the first one by sheer luck. Oh my god. I'm on the second one. But it wants me to go to a the lost sector in Soros Harbor, and I've never done that one, so I'm looking for it. Oh, yeah, I know which one that is. If I remember right, that's the one with all the um, fallen. Yes, I'm going to use a guy. One good thing about the lost sectors, okay. one good thing about the lost sectors is that you find it once, and then it's going to be on the map always, so that's cool. Well, it's still on the map. I just need to find the entrance, which I think I found the entrance. Yeah. Oh, it is a bit of a hard entrance to find. Why do the additional bounties cost 3,000 glimmer? This just makes no sense to me. So you can keep on doing things infinitely? It should be like 5,000 um. Additional bounties from the Prismatic Blaster doesn't give you season 2 and CISO and nothing else. What's the point of it, man? Are you reasonable? Yeah. I'll just grab additional bounties for each year. We don't get much compared to the uh, dailies and the, the weeklies. But it yeah. all just stacks up in the end, though. Even 10 XP, still 10 XP times, mm. you know, how many weeks it is. Yeah. I, wish I, ha I wish I could have bounties. It's also recommended to grab the, um, <laughs> uh, the um, black armory bounties as well. Do those ones as well. Yeah, I yeah, do those as well. I can literally hold like I think four hey, bounties do... at a time. Do you want to? Do you want to do an RE just for fun? What sir? Do you want to do an agility just for fun? Yeah, I can do a menagerie. Bit of a rough, but in the middle would be a waste of time. Yeah, I was talking about the normal because we don't have six people. Oh, I can wait for people to do her RFD. I thought you could do it with like three people. I mean, Probably. I'm sure you can. You can also ask. Yeah, I'll do, uh, do I have to do anything extra to unlock Heroic Menagerie? Um, once I unlock Menagerie. You, you have, have to unlock it. Yeah, other than that, because you I think I literally menagerie. just have to talk to Warner. And then I unlock it, I think. I don't know. Find out after How I many guns can you be in on the... How many guns can you be on the tower and you haven't tried to get them? I've got to get another three... In terms of... Because I've got the Master Witch Alice, but I'm just looking at the, uh, the Jotun and the uh, Limala. I need to do three more legendary frames, and then I've got those two weapons. Yep, i got to do three... I've got to do four more. Four more. I wish yeah. the Ballistic Logs were uh, character-based. Uh, uh, count base instead of character base. Um, yeah. They're gonna help you with. They're gonna help you with that. I can do that. Myself. I've got. I've got one ballistic box sitting there, and I'll just grab two bounties off um, eight or one, and then boom. Yep. Yeah. And I'll have the. Um, oh, yeah. 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 That should be the case. If she's not that stupid, needs seven weekly bounties. A daily bounties or whatever it is. Yep, which means I won't be able to do it till tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I got the 
know, if you want me to get killed, I want to be able to get the yard, and there will be more knocking to tomorrow. What's today's forge? Is it Nagi? No, 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 it, it not the, the best one. Is it Nami? Yeah, that one. Okay, I need to do that as well. So much. It is yeah. the worst forge. Out of all of them. It, yeah. It, I hit it as well. And the way the forge yeah, is hard. It's not because of the men, it's like because of the blueberries. Because they don't have the frozen balls. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I didn't know. Yeah. Either. I was always just staying up in the center, and I was like, why are there all these orbs showing up here? What's going on? I didn't know, so I knew that the side corners were there, but what I was doing was I was going down, picking one up, and then taking the gate, you know, the thrower back up, and then throwing it from there. Wait, that actually makes me want to ask a question. When you do the corrupted strike, did you know that you could pass the ball to other place? Um, yes, because Mel told me. Because I did my first corrupted strike uh, yesterday, I, really, I think. I'd never done it before then. Yeah. I really want to talk to a blueberry who doesn't know where them and ask them why they can't just think out of the box. I mean, isn't thinking out of the box just putting you in a slightly larger box? I mean, I figured it out by myself without even helping Yeah, I figured out the throwing stuff as well. All that stuff. I've never done the corrupted though. So. The, um, the forges had a... All the forges have this behavior that there is a ball that was dropped and you walk over it. You pick it up automatically. And the thing is, on an enemy, the people on the drive and the corrupted Thing that happens all of the time at throwing balls. I'm sorry. The thing that happens all the time is that you are using your super, you are really mad, and you step over a ball. Yes, that's happened to me so many times. And it's so annoying. Yeah, that but... If it's already been broken, if it's a fresh ball that works, you can't pick up. If it's already been burped and it's been missed, um, then you're stuck. Yep, yeah. that's what I mean with throw. But you shouldn't really be using the super off the top of your area. That should be lifting the players down the line. And you can do more than enough damage with your weapons on the other area without using the super. Like but I like my super. <laughs> I'll be honest with that. To be honest, I don't really use my super until the boss comes out. These pants from the um, prophecy wraith from Hunter makes it look like I'm good wearing skinny jeans. <laughs> Sexy. The pants from the um, season of the War team for the Titan makes it look the Titan like he has a big ass. It looks like <laughs> as he's fantastic. Have you seen the <laughs> prophecy dungeon uh, pants in the war? No, I get that. It makes it look like you got a front butt. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. Oh, exotic game. It's like a pair of chinos. Is it garbage oh, good. it goes? I can't pick it up. No! No, it goes as well. Don't crit. Yeah, they will. Don't crit goes like that. Don't crit goes like that. Otherwise, you it goes that with that with Uh, nope. Not I mean. Hey, um, I have a theory about ghosts. Do you remember the scene one when you go to the archives and oh, you go yeah, say Shin. something like your your ghost say something like, okay, let me take care of this, and it goes to do something with the security, and the computer of the archive acknowledge the ghost and tell him, uh. Good night. Uh, nice to see you, Doctor. Uh, yeah, it's like uh, Doctor yeah. Shin. Shall I what? run Vex Core analysis? He said what? Whatever. The reason yeah, for that and... can be easily explained by the reason is that he's got the codes, the command codes yeah. for that person mm -hmm. when he scans the body. So that the AI is just registering the Walters. command codes. Yeah. Because why would he be oh, no. on? Because A, it can't be your ghost. Your ghost comes from. 
I mean, I guess the travelers stole the. So I remember seeing a theory that what the you know that everyone's trying to grow their light, and eventually the travelers just gonna consume all of us and fix itself and then leave. The only yeah, but possible the, the case, wait, 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 wait! Listen to me, listen to me. But my theory is that maybe he is actually that doctor, and ghosts are actually that. Ghosts are actual ghosts. And the travel just well, the, the, invite people and put them in, in a shell. It's a ghost. It's a literal only... ghost. It's not like a it's not like a metaphorical ghost. It is a ghost. Well, the only other possible explanation is your character, your guardian, is that doctor. Yeah, but why would you be in the cosmodrome? Like, why did you fall off the wall or whatever? Yeah. Like, what would someone but so then important? Can't be because you scan the, the body of the doctor that who um, you get the code from. Mm. So it's not you. Yeah. <laughs> the ghost resurrects your dead, your dead skeleton. Mm. You know what, uh, you know what, uh, the doctor's real name is? What is this firewall data fragments? If you, um, if you play Contact enough, Eris will say Drift the drifter's real name. Uh, yeah, Jermaine. Yeah, Jermaine, apparently that's yeah, not actually his even name. his real name. That's like his first fake name, apparently, that you're seeing online. And that Eris is not her real name either, but then there's a whole debate about this. She's so fucking... There's so many theories about her. One theory is that she's an artificial AI that's taken a human form to infiltrate the Guardians and the Tower to work for, like, the Vex. Another one is that she's, like, the uh, Apostle of the Darkness and all this shit. It's ridiculous how many theories there are for Eris. I mean, reading the logs or whatever from this quest I'm doing now, Xenophage, Calling her Eris and just saying like you know Eris brought us all together the six to go down and kill kill Quota. Mm. And so there. there was a there was more logs in the uh, during the Forsaken DLC where um, every time you go to the Oracle and you talk to whatever her name is, uh, Team Arasol, you get the lore entry and you get the lore entry that talks about um, Eris. You're right, yeah, the Eris Roman talks to the Queen. Street. But that's all fabricated. It was all false. Mm. Uh, it was admitted later that that's that's a fabricated story for her because she doesn't actually rem she doesn't actually remember her actual history. Mm. I'm still not convinced Marisov is real. I haven't seen her yet. She could still be an AI. That's what I thought. Yeah, you saw her in her um, in her assembly line. No, I haven't. And you also physically saw her in Destiny 1 as well. Well, yeah, I mean, but after she died from the, you know, the Taken King thing and all that stuff. Oh, she definitely died, but mm. she she was smart because she has an Ascendant Realm. So that's her no, Ascendant Realm. I know, I'm just saying I still haven't actually seen her in this game yet, so... Oh, did you not do the Oracle thing during the second? I, I don't even know how... I've been in the Dreaming City, like, twice. I don't like that place. Oh, okay. well, how long have you been playing Disney 2 for? Uh, since it be, um, since October of 2016. And I stopped playing in Warmind because it totally burnt myself out doing the cash things for the World Line Exotic. Oh, yeah. and I didn't start playing I came last... back for Forsaken. Yeah. yeah, and I kind of... Every third week, um, you would get, uh, it would be fully taken, the entire, entire Dream City. And you would get a reward, which would allow you to go, a gift of the Oracle. And you could take it to this oracle machine, and then it would open a portal into her ascendant realm, and she was sitting on a throne. You can still do that, by the way. But... Yeah. yeah. I'm just disappointed. Yeah, I've seen the, to, you know, yeah, like. I haven't. Mm. I haven't been able to get to her, to see her, uh, and I have done two things bounties, so I have to do them all. Okay. How do you leave the Soros Harbor boss sector? Like, I killed the boss, and now I'm just jumping around. And I found something that's like, insufficient firewall. Hang like, am I stuck here now? I'm gonna win my first competitive season because uh, the other two has a no good. Okay. 
Yeah, but I'm not sweating it, so it's not like... Nothing. Hey guys, do you like avocado? What? <laughs> okay, I'm back like now. I'm just talking to my foot, uh, my foot, mate. It's okay. Avocado? Like avocado. I don't know what that is. Guacamole, dude. Guacamole. Never had it. Guacamole. Avo avocados? Yeah, never had guacamole. Neither have I. Sounds too... What? Hipster. Why? I don't what? eat condiments. Guacamole, I... I like guacamole, I don't like avocados. Like, I don't like avocado toast, but I can do guacamole. Isn't, isn't guacamole made from avocado, yes. though? It's like mashed avocados. Yeah. Yes, it's with, weird. Like, lemon juice, I'm guessing, or something? It's like lemon or lime, mm. and then, um, like, onions, mm. um... Yeah, that's the... Uh, you should not eat guacamole or avocado with lemon. That's the wrong way. Yeah, it's lime. It's lime. Never. Yeah. My never, generation never has that. ruined mm. that, fr that, fr that fruit for me anyway. I mean, they've turned it into a hipster thing, so I avoid it with a passion. Mm. It just doesn't interest me. No, 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 no. I just don't like food. Oh, what the am thing, I doing? The, thi the thing yeah. is, uh, that thing here in South America is super cheap, so it's like a thing that you eat like every day if you want to. It's not like super cheap, it's still expensive, but it's not like... It's but it's in like everywhere, so you can get it however you want to. No, it's, it's pretty easy. Like one. I think it's like two dollars for a single other party. Over here. No, for two for one dollar here you can get like um, one kilogram. My girlfriend just told me it's about four to five dollars for a single avocado here in New Zealand. Yeah. Really, dude? That's fucking expensive. Yeah, they're probably, oh, our food they're and stuff over in there is insanely overpriced. A block of a kg block of cheese over here can go anywhere from about six to ten dollars. But are we talking New Zealand dollars or U.S. dollars? New Zealand dollars. Mm, what's the comparison? But you know the worst part is we have one of the biggest dairy farm, a dairy um, uh, farm things on the on the planet, and yet we still get overcharged for our milks and stuff. The, it's the same thing that happened with avocado. We we are like one of the biggest avocado producers, and we still get overcharged char for avocado because that's how our economy works. Because if you sum up all of the oh. earnings, then you are keep generating earnings. Yeah, like a small rice cake. It's always funny to you. If you if you make it, you get charged more because the majority of the time the food's been exported to other countries where it is cheaper. And you have to export back. That might be why. Actually, happens to us with some of our wool. Some of our wool gets made, gets um, farmed in New Zealand, sent to another country, and then sent back to us. I think that might happen with our potatoes as well. I live in Idaho, so yeah. that's all we're We can make that almost and everything that can possibly be made, um, apart from like rice and stuff in New Zealand. Mm -hmm. I know Australia has like one of the biggest nuclear or uranium mining things I think in the world. Well, I think it's. Australia. I'm mining for food, not mining for uh, resources. Oh, <laughs> I mean you've never had nuclear. We have one. Of Talk about nuclear cookies all the time in my classes. This is not freaking Fallout. <laughs> no, it's a metaphor for like the different types of radiation. Uh, can we get nuclear cookies? Um, I mean, <laughs> am I gonna get powers? The, can I get powers? All Dude, ra you're a nuclear radiation no, doesn't work me, like I'm that, by the way. Powers. It only brings no, you're death. Die. Yeah, oh, come on. Radiation only Seriously. brings death. No, but no, but what if I 
Are, are you nope, sure you ate a spider first? Nope. And then the spider's gonna right. die. Because that's not how mm. radiation works. Bah, you radiate bah, something, bah. you have to activate it. And that's gonna be, I think, kind of hard for, like, organic chemicals, I don't think, activate well. Because you have to turn something else radioactive. The only reason the radiation, it's not very easy. The only reason it really works in movies and TV shows and comic books is because the majority of the time, the person it happens to has DNA in their body that activates, as you're saying, when they are infected. Where in general humans, natural humans in real life, different type of activation. Special DNA. That's not yeah, activating like that a recessive DNA gene. That's like the, turning something radioactive. Wow, I, th I th we don't have that special stuff in our body like the superhero characters do. The only thing I know about activating yeah, so you're it telling me there is a chance. Cool. See, that's the <laughs> annoying yes, thing. There's yeah, there's one in an one over infinity chance that you'll become a mutant. Yes, so there's a chance. Yeah. Same amount of chance that no, 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 everything. One over. Is. One. Yeah, but one over uh, infinity is no chance. No, it's a chance. It's not zero. It's just a very, no, it's very, no. very, very, very... It's infinitely small infinitesimal above small. Uh, zero, so there's a chance. As you said. It's Interesting an enough, unrealistic chance. Mutants exist in real life. We just keep picture mutants as like X-Men and stuff like that. If you have uh, hexachromal eyes or whatever the hell it's called, the one where you've got um, two different colored eyes, mm -hmm. that's a mutation in your DNA. Dichromal, I think. Yeah, actually, actually, the whole um, evolution theory it's about yeah. mutation because Beneficial. if you have a, a fish thing and the fish get legs, it's a mutation. You know, all I've heard about is, is fish losing legs, even though whales aren't fish, but you know. Um. Little side tip, well, um, you have this one, if you don't already know, um, you need six blue runes to get the full set of um, uh, opulence armor. So if you don't have six blue runes, um, and also you need a, at least two of each of the blue runes, of the three, of because the, there's three of them, to get the full set of armor. Is there a guide for what you're talking Otherwise, about? Otherwise. Yeah, there is. Okay, cool. uh, and the video and the video hey. has a an attached um, recipe for each piece of gear. And the and the comments. What are you doing? Who? What are you doing? Uh, I'm at orbits. I've actually you've actually um watching me called me into wanting to get them. The set of opulence gear on my other characters. Do you wanna get the do you wanna play Menagerie? Yeah, yeah. And... load it up. I've got my um uh, send me an invite, I'll, I've got my hunter, I'll do it on my hunter and get the set of armor on my hunter. I'll just use the, dupl the Mel chest duplication method huh? at the end. Do you wanna get, um... Do you wanna play me here? Uh, just for fun? Let me see. Yeah, let me see. I suppose for not fun. I don't have a ton of runes, which makes me sad. I haven't really let rune splurging lately. But I have some. Do you have how many blue runes do you have? Um, I don't have. I don't know if I have any blue runes. Do you have a, Do you have them unlocked to actually be able to get them? Nope. Do you uh, have to unlock them? Yeah. yeah, rune compatibility three. Yeah, no, uh, I'm not there yet. I got it. Do you want to do the reckoning? Yes. Well, the reckoning. I can only do reckoning one. There is four of us. We can do the reckoning. I can only do reckoning one. Okay. Yeah, I hate me too. I Don't worry to about it. For that to get the one. Wait, what am I doing? Where did I land? Where did I go? Are you in the cosmodrome. Wait, what? Are you... <sighs> oh. That is what we're. That what? is what we are trying to figure it out. We are trying to figure it I... out. What? <laughs> <laughs> I forgot We're where I, to I forgot I forgot what activity I selected and I like went into a strike with no radar so I was like well, where am I what am I doing what's going on oh that's cool Dreg from a mile away <gasps> killed me but, 
The Shadow of the Century. Yeah, the Menagerie. The Menagerie is going I, I away have next season. I have something that we can do the three of us. I have something that we can do the three of us. Rat What's team. That? Do you have a rat team? Yes, I do. I've already, I've already got the rat king. I don't. Do you have the Somebody rat king quest or do you have the rat king rat king? I have the rat king. I've got rat the rat king rat king. Oh. Can you help me to get my rat king? Can you help me also? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> You're doing the Xenophage. Yeah, I know, I'm working on it. I'm <laughs> half done. Okay, weapon. I can whip him. You want the Rat King or do you want the Xenophage? Um, <laughs> Xenoph uh, Rat King, because I don't like the Xenophage. It's made me feel sad. You need the oh, that means that. That means that you one need of it. you. That means. Yeah. It's actually better <laughs> if two of you are uh, actually on the Rat King quest than two people not. More beneficial. That's actually oh. true. Most beneficial. Wait, does it do more? Do you get like more progress or whatever? More well, no, it just means you both yeah, get the same progress too, as opposed to two people who don't have it. Oh, more. now the door. Yeah, all right. Oh. All right. So I'm gonna do the rat king with you see later. All right. Let me I'll see what help you guys. I have. Let me see what else quests I have that I can ask for help. I really gotta start working on getting the um the bad juju catalyst which means I'm to get all these fucking traps. How do you unlock like bad juju? I have a quest for it, but I'm not sure what the quest is. Uh, you just gotta get a certain amount yeah. of things unlocked inside the tribute hall. Yeah. Yeah. Like the tribute hall. And yeah, but you have to. Place. You have to get. How many is? You have to go to the tribute hall first. So if you don't have Menagerie, yeah. you don't have the tribute hall. Yeah, you I need know. to get the tribute hall first, and then that quest is gonna eventually lead you to have one quest inside the tribute hall. So you go to the tribute hall, and there is gonna be a something that is, you can take, like uh, when you're on a patrol zone and you take a quest, you take that thing, you get the bad you, and then after that you start working on the bad you catalyst. I already got my bad you catalyst, and I am so happy. So the only Damn, advice congrats. I can give you about <laughs> about the but do you get out is the following. You only need forty five out of fifty tributes. So the hardest five forget about those. The hardest five are Scorch of the Past, uh, Leviathan, Crown of Sorrow, Last Witch and one hundred K on on Nightfall wearing the full armor. Those two, those five, forget about them. The, the other, the others, you only need to grind a lot of activities, like by example, play a lot of Crucible, play a lot of Gambit, play a lot of uh, Strikes. The only one that is hard of the remaining 45 is the one that you need to get points from uh, Strikes and while using the armor, the, the opponent's armor and the weapons. So, put the bad Juju, put whatever secondary you want, use the Throne Cleaver and the opponent's armor, and go to the second difficulty of the Nightfall ordeal. That one has matchmaking and has also um Wait, Nightfall is matchmaking? Champions. That one. Since one. Yeah, uh, depending on the what level. Nightfall ordeal, ordeal up to hero. Once you go past hero, yeah. it's you have to have a fire team. And yeah, that's so where that you one, get That one is going to give you the... Yeah, <laughs> the, the the hero one is gonna give you a lot of progress on that on, on, on that particular statue. You only need like do it two or three times and you're gonna get one hundred percent of that thing. So are we doing an item just for fun? Okay, yeah, let's just do an anniversary. I'll get I'll work on getting the um the armor for it for my hunter. Can somebody invite me, please? Let me go to what the, is the Menagerie Siege? I'll invite... Uh, I'll, let me get the wallet first. I'm in the tribute hall right now. Let me say the tribute hall will be going, because it's really useful for damage analysis. For play, for people to uh, figure out how much a weapon does damage. Yeah, I really wish it weren't deleting half the game. Okay, Menagerie is arc. Mel, do you want to do Menagerie for fun? I can't um, invite you, Kutiko. You've got your ship locked down hard. It's true, he does. Uh, I'm... I don't know uh, why. Nope. 
Okay. Uh, yeah, I want to finish the strike for my pinnacle, and then... Go, oh, finish the strike, we don't wait you. Oh, What's the... that Google? I can, I can join you, Kaiser, as well. Why can't you join me? It doesn't let me, and I can't see you on my friend list because I can see you on my not friends. <laughs> I can't, I can't see you on the clan thing because we're not on the same time. I'm in the tower. Give me a second. Uh, you need to change your friend setting to. Oh uh, no, 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 don't worry. I'll fix it. Give me a second. I'll just add you as a friend. Problem solved. That way you can actually we can join each other. I'll send you the thing. You think we can be friends? Solved. Do you think we can be friends? I don't know. I don't know. Man. Can we be friends? Can <laughs> Why can we be friends? friends? Oh yeah, we're we're friends Why can because we, we both be friends. We are we're friends because we we're both friends. thought about the silly stuff. What about the song? I hate this no, I guy. Like this. this me. Invite to go. No? No? Fuck you, Bungie. Didn't want to invite you anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Invite the gay. I'm in orbit. Are you in orbit? I'm in orbit. I'm changing my loadout now. Uh, Damn it, Cactus. They spent so much me. money on loadout. I can't even add you. I can't even do it. It's like, not, I have to. I don't know what to do. Ah. I don't to fix this. I'm gonna do this. Home. Restart destiny. Yeah. <sighs> I need to put aside like a day or two and just get a bunch of people who who are willing to get all the menagerie uh, triumphs completed. Triumphs yeah. for this yes. season. Yeah. I, that's us. I want to. That's us. I want to. Economy. Well, if you if you're willing to do it, Nick. Uh, uh, Either this week or next week, I'm more than willing, I'm more than happy to go through and get all that shit done, so I never have to do it again. Don't worry, Bungie will fit. I'll make sure for on that. Oh, wait, <laughs> let me do it. And I enjoy. I I, I, I love getting um, traps. You can see that number go up. Yep. Money at 60k. I'm at 14k. Isn't Baxter's at like 130 or something, or some insane amount? I had a friend who was almost at 100%. Yep, and I like can never do it again. Guess he'll never be back. I have 57. If you miss, it's like most of the game is like if you miss a single week in Destiny 2, at any point from day one of Destiny 2 to now. There's a high chance you're not going to get every single a triumph in the game. That's pretty much how this game is designed. Yep, and it's awful. Yeah. By example, the things we were talking about are <sighs> uh, the monstrosity. Okay, I'm ready. Now. How can we join together? I'm just loading up the game again, but it keeps giving me police connected Xbox Live. <laughs> <laughs> 